forever wearing a beanie because my hair is too gay to function. What's up? It's Wednesday with Dakota. Um, this week's topic is one thing that you can't leave your house without. So I'm fun. I'm a fun guy. So the things that I can't leave my house without include pretty much the normal things, which are my phone, water bottle, and my medicine. That, that makes me sound like I'm crazy. I'm not crazy. I don't think I could make this video with a straight face, but just so you know, it is all completely 100% serious. So the sun is deciding to like block my face, but that's okay because we're doing this anyway. Okay, so number one, this is Klaus. He is the Santa version in my collection and he's just a baby and that's all he'll ever be. I think I need to give a little background to the story. Okay, so it started a month ago when Garrett and I were going Christmas shopping for our families and friends who we needed to buy Christmas presents for and we went to Five Below and Garrett saw him and made the most unnatural noise I think anyone could ever make. It was like a combination of a squeal and a scream and it was just it was just adorable he begged me for like 20 minutes to buy it for him and I said no um, so we didn't get it the first time around which okay yeah I'm an old full boyfriend but I made up for it because I had to go back later that day to get my sister's Christmas present so I got Klaus and I kept it a secret. I hid it in the trunk of my car. It was the only place that I could like hide it that he wouldn't find it because as you guys know we live together. And we were setting up our Christmas tree on Christmas Eve actually. And we were starting to wrap presents and I was like there is no way that I'm going to be able to hide this from him and wrap it and be able to give it to him actually on Christmas. And he actually brought up how much he wanted to go to, to Five Below and buy this beanie ball so <laughs> I went to go to the trunk of my car and I brought it in and once again he made the most unnatural squeal so then came Bumblebee and we actually got him because my cat who lives with my mom his name is Captain he has a collar with bumblebees on it but we figured that Klaus needed a friend so then we went back three days ago and we saw this one. We don't know if it's a whale or a seal, but we think it's a seal. So after we watch Bones a lot and we're like obsessed with Bones, so we decided to name him Sealy after. So we decided that we needed to take these three wherever we went. And they are our family. They are our little baby family. We have Klaus, Sealy, Bumblebee, and we have Klaus. But yeah, if you guys see us in real life, we'll always have these three on us. They will either be in our car or like in a bag or somewhere. The other thing that I can't leave my house without, well, it's not a thing. He's a person. And that's Garrett. We go everywhere together except when he's at work and I'm here by myself, which I am now. And I'm really lonely, but that's okay. Okay, well I have to go. This video is already five minutes of absolutely nothing. So I will see you next week, guys. Bye. Forever wearing a beanie because my hair is good to the. Dude, I'm totally serious. What was I gonna say? I don't remember. Sun's so bright. Seriously, like, are you, is, is this a joke? So, yeah, the, we, no.